which one it is. I've done it again! I've saved the city from the scheming scourge of scurryless scum. He's so obnoxious, so arrogant, so conceited. It's gotta be Dad. Goslin, I told you never to tag along on my adventures. Just for that, I'm docking your allowance for a week. I don't care if you take away my allowance, Dad. I'm just glad to have you back. Dad, wake up! We got a cave! <gasps> Come on, Darkwing! <clears throat> it's on TV downstairs! Uh, Goslin, after I get up and have my cup of coffee, Remind me to punish you <coughs> severely. Come on, it's a case. Oh. <laughs> Can we find a more pleasant way of waking me, like high explosives under my pillow, perhaps? This is definitely a job for Darkwing Duck. Right. We're all set to go. We are going nowhere. You can go to the baseball game like planned. Honker, you can use my ticket. No way! But I know about underground stuff. Like when the evil worm people were turning kids into zombie slaves. You put extra sugar on your Frostios this morning, didn't you? So? This isn't a comic book. It's reality. Look, Goslin, I'm not going to chance getting you hurt on one of my cases. You just turn mushy whenever things start getting fun. Well, what I say goes. Besides, it's probably just another takeover the world scheme. We'll be back by dinner. It's too dangerous. You could have been hurt. You're just jealous. I had things under control until you threw me in that skull. Yeah, she's right, D.W. You were kind of overprotective. I am not overprotective. And I certainly don't treat her like a baby. You shouldn't take such big fights. Yeah, okay. So old habits are hard to break. Sue me. But I'll... I'll try. Thanks, Dad. Let's get dangerous. Ahem. Just as long as you're careful. Dad! All right, it's quiver wing time! Uh, remember, got quiver wing. <laughs> careful is as careful does. Dad? Okay, okay, forget I said anything. Come on, Arrow Kid. I mean, after all, I'm just a father who can't help but care for his daughter. That's all! <laughs> they grow up so quickly. I was right to begin with. You aren't old enough to handle being a hero. Now go to your room. Go to my room? See, you never treated me like a hero. You just treat me like your baby girl! Because you are. Goslin! Dad. You first. No, you. I, I just want to say that you've got potential, kid. Someday the crooks of St. Canard will quake at the coming of Quiverwing Quack. Thanks, Dad. So, by someday, you mean like what? Next month? <laughs> I can see that. I'll be a lot more mature by then. Of course, I'm a quick study. I could be ready in a couple of weeks, maybe sooner. And if you let me skip my homework, I... The daring Darkwing Duck defies death yet again and defeats the despicable denizens of darkness. Oh, Dad. I'm very proud of you, Goslin. There! It's all back, just like I promised. Well, guys, uh... I wanted to give you this, but... Mega Blasters of Death! Oh, King Gear! <laughs> Aren't you forgetting something? Oh, yeah. Thanks, Dad. <laughs> Thanks, but uh, that wasn't what I meant. Oh, no! Recycled. One TV set. Oh. Oh, come on. Sign here, dear. Sweetie, love of my life. My beneficiary. Tell you what, Dad, you take me to the premiere of Son of Conjo tonight, and I'll... Sign it? You sign it? Oh, seriously consider it. Little does she know, Son of Conjo is not on my no list. Little does he know it was until I erased it. Uh-oh. Is our Goslin acting like a perfect little lady? <laughs> Practically perfect in every way. Thanks to Darkwing Duck! <clears throat> and family. Not bad for a day's work.
work, huh? Da, 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 there, Missy. Your day isn't over yet. My homework? Reports due tomorrow. Goslin, what are you doing here? Well, I know how much you hate crushed ice. What a kid. Whoa! You know, Goslin, giving the Muddlefoots your presents was a pretty nice thing to do. I'm so proud of you. Thanks, Dad. Well, Darkwing's reputation is safe. Steelbeak's in the slammer, the egrets in the shop. And you and Gizmo Duck made a great team. Well, I had to teach old Giz a thing or two, but... Uh... <laughs> I knew you wouldn't really betray me. No, it's the first rule of investigative reporting. Make them think you're on their side, and when they least expect it, whammo! After all, I did break us out of Hamburger Hippo, didn't I? That's not all you broke. It's nothing. A mere scratch in the line of duty. Where is Goslin? Uh, outside playing ball. How can she play baseball at dinner time? <laughs> oh my gosh! But Goslin, if that braille's just too weak, you might. <laughs> Goslin! I just stepped out the front door. Your concern for me is touching. You're alive! And you're not moving at super speed. If he remembers Goslin, he'll use her to get to me. Morning, Dad. Rough night at the office? Huh? Goslin, where are you going? It's Saturday. Soccer practice. Well, you can't go outside and sock today. I mean, it's... I'm, I mean... Uh, you're grounded. Grounded? What for? Uh, for not picking up your room. I never pick up my room. You're gonna have to do better than that. I don't have to. I'm a parent. Hmm. Oh, look, Goslin, it's for your own good. Can we just leave it at that, huh? Fine. I'll just wait for my bread and water upstairs. Poor kid. She's sure taking it hard. Well, I refuse to feel guilty. I don't want her out there where Bulba might find her. He nearly killed her once to get to me, and I won't risk that again. Way to go, Dad! Boy, am I glad you're all right. Hey, what's the matter? Don't you trust me? Uh, I want to apologize, Goslin, for not telling you the truth. I was wrong. Oh, you mean I was the right one for a change? Well... For a change. Good job, guys. Too bad you had to find out your idol was just a rotten, self-centered egomaniac interested only in cheap publicity. Hey, don't be so hard on yourself, Dad. I was talking about Bianca Bickley. Oh, <laughs> well, uh, remember, you were my idol way before she was. Ah, that's my girl. <laughs> of course I was. <laughs> I'm still not raising your allowance. I was worth a shot. Thank <laughs> you.